everybody home in Michigan today and I got a special project that's going on I've got my new truck behind me and the team from rough tough has flown in to install the new seat covers the last couple vehicles I've had I've been fortunate to have rough tough seat covers on them and they are durable tough and made in the US exactly what I need for my active lifestyle and I'm pretty fortunate because the guys flew in today to install these seat covers so we're gonna let the guys do the install today and hear from the professionals the best way and all the hidden secrets to install your rough tough seat covers So on Mark's seat covers, what we've done is he's chosen a perforated soft touch. Um, the reason he chose perforated soft touch is he has heated seats and cooled seats, so he still wanted to have that feature available. So we've done a perforated soft touch as the insert. We diamond quilted it, which means it almost has an inch of foam on the insert pieces. And then we've done a soft touch trim to give him that leather feel still. On the back of these front seat covers, we've done our special ops package, which is a molly loop system. We have cargo pockets. This is actually turns into a rifle scabbard. You just open this up, slide your rifle through the backrest here. You can seal that back up. And when you're not using it as a rifle scabbard, use it, hold your iPad, whatever else you want to put in there. And then on the bottom, see if I can pull this out here. This opens up and you can hold your compound bow or your crossbow down here as you're traveling. So you don't have to put it back in the case if you're just going a short distance. So really awesome um, pocket storage system on the back of the seat covers. So we put that on there for him. We're gonna go ahead and get this installed. When you're doing your install, take your time, lay out your pieces and, and get it on there nice and snug, snug so it doesn't move around as you're sliding in and out of your truck. Once you do that, you don't have to take them off ever again. They're gonna last you a long time. So as you can see here, each seat cover is designed for the year, make and model of vehicle. So when you put it on, it should fit exactly like your OEM seat is. And so you can see here, we've actually had these headrest holes cut out. You can slide them around your post so you get that really nice finish, factory finish. So it doesn't look baggy or, or um, saggy when you put it on. You should have a nice tight fit. And again, they shouldn't slide around on you when you're done. All right, we're about to install, install the backrest here. One of the things that we do when we install, we start at the bottom, so we always install our bottom piece first. Get that tucked in in between the seat back and the bottom, get it all nice and snug, and then we move to the backrest. What you're gonna to wanna to do is work your way from the top down, so you're gonna tighten as you go. Again, we have headrest uh, cutouts here, so you're gonna actually wrap those around these plastic housings for the headrest. Our goal with these seat covers is make it look like OEM, like it came from the factory. So again, snug it up as you work down, then cinch everything down at the bottom in between. You'll see here, I'll start tucking down in between the backrest and the bottom. Once you do that, just start snugging and it should look really nice and tight when you're done. This is just an example of the custom nature of the product. So we don't cover any of your electric controls. Everything should tuck in behind the plastic. So if you have a plastic panel, our seat covers are designed to tuck in underneath that plastic panel to give you that nice custom look. Again, we don't want the baggy um, baggy look or any of your accessories covered over, child safety hooks, anything like that, controls. We, all, we want it all to look like it came from the factory. So this is one example of what we do here. So tuck in any extra material behind the plastic housing right here to give it that nice custom look. Well, the guys are about halfway done with the install and it's looking awesome. On this one, just like my last one, I got the special op package, which for me, it's just, it's a must have, right? So I can fit shotguns or rifles or my bow in there, but truthfully I've got kids. So, I mean, they end up using these pockets and just, just about everything. Again, extremely tough and durable so they can put through what I put it through and also what my kids put it through. All right, now that we're almost done with installing the front seats, we're just snugging those up right now. A uh, quick install tip, as you're sliding these back seat covers over, you notice that there's a lot of Velcro where this carpet goes. Roll that Velcro up as you pull down, or unless, uh, if you don't, sorry, you're gonna be fighting that Velcro all the way as you're tugging. So roll that up and then pull, and then 
uh, pull tight and then cinch it down with the Velcro. It makes it a lot easier. So that way, as you're, as you're trying to install this thing, you don't wanna be fighting on each side. So roll everything up as much as you can, slide it down and then attach that Velcro. That Velcro is pretty sticky and it can cause a lot of problems. This is a perfect example when we talk about custom seat covers you can see here we're allowing for every opening for the seat to attach properly for you to still recline the seat back we still allow the strap to come through again our headrest cutouts right here and then if you look down here this is important to the families that are buying seat covers you still have access to your child safety hooks down here to strap in your car your um, your children's car seats so again everything if there's a cutout on your car or truck we'll have a cutout for it in our seat covers just to make sure that everything still functions properly. All right, another aspect of our seat covers here is if you have a fold-down armrest in your rear seat, we're gonna allow you to access that fold-down armrest. So we're um, halfway done installing this right now, but you can see here that this, uh, this will still fold. You have access to your, uh, your cup holder still. Here is the actual cover that goes over that. You can see that you'll still have access to those cup holders when we're done. All right, so what we've done on the front of Mark's front seat, um, just like we did in his last truck, we put a pistol pocket on here. The nice thing about these pistol pockets, it sits right underneath your leg, so you never even know it's there. You open it up, you can fit your pistol and actually two magazines. So you always have your, your sidearm with you, you always have enough ammunition with you. And when you're done at the end of the day or you wanna go out to the range, you just rip it right off the seat, take it with you. And then when you're done at the range or you will come back to your truck, just throw it right back on and attach it right there. Again, nice, it's convenient. That way there's a safety measure to it. You can take it with you. It's not left in your truck if you don't want it there. Um, just a great option to have on the front of your seat. Well, the guys just finished up putting in the seat covers and just like the last couple they look amazing mark thanks again man i love your seat covers again extremely tough durable 100 made in the u.s from a great group of people thanks, thanks for sir. letting us come out yeah no problem appreciate it